the beach to the pool. So, we're gonna enjoy having this pool completely to ourselves. Honey. Because that Honey. doesn't happen every day. Honey. Honey. Your beer's floating away. Oh no. We've been here in the thump music and we've been jamming up to our uh, Santana which we like way more but uh, so we're gonna go to the the bumping music over here by the pool and cool off that way hopefully we can find some uh, shade yes it's a beautiful walk along the beach to the pool area it's like you're walking right next to the jungle jungle literally grows onto the beach so this is where we were at last night yeah. we sat yeah. right there yeah, we sat right there in those chairs and we sat here and watched the stars. I saw two fallen stars last night. It was so cool. I always wanted to sit on the beach in the pitch black and listen to the waves hit the shore and watch the stars. And we did that last night. We, we, uh, we cut some music on the phone and it was awesome. And then once you sit out here for a while, your eyes adjust mm -hmm. to things and you can start to see pretty clear yeah you could just from the moonlight things that you can only do when you stay in an all-inclusive correct mundo cannot do that on a cruise ship folks and that was priceless yes it was <laughs> which pool do we choose honey I don't know, there's so many to choose so many. from we could choose from the infinity pool. Yes. It's so funny. Me and Jason just landed on the perfect spot at the same time. Block my pale butt from a uh, further sunburn. He's so nice. He's moving the umbrella so I don't get burned. Oh yeah. It's already looking better. Okay, I'll be back with the towel. Thank you. Perfect. Our new spot. Uh, hold on. Okay. Our new spot is completely perfect. Our awesome attendant put the umbrella to where it's actually blocking the sun. So I can sit here in complete shade. See, all shade. Thank you. A walk-in pool right here. This is a super, super nice pool. behind us is the infinity pool so literally right there I mean so we've got a pool in front of us a pool behind us there's music playing but it's in the distance so it's not so loud over here so perfect for me um, so we're gonna post up here for the rest of the evening until it's time to get ready for dinner because we actually have not stepped foot in these pools yet so it's definitely time that we need to do that you know what that Caribbean Sun is a killer it doesn't matter how much sunscreen you put on. It doesn't matter how careful you are. You're going to get burned. So me and Jason both have a bit of a burn. We're still trying to be as careful as possible. That's why we've got shade on us right now. We're going to venture out into the pools. But we're hoping in about another hour or so the sun will be down behind the buildings. And that's when it's perfect for me. Because then I can get out and enjoy the pools without worrying about getting sunburned. So post up number two for the day okay let me just say this is a completely unbiased opinion this is true what i feel right now this place is complete heaven it is gorgeous the weather is beautiful the beach is awesome there's palm trees and greenery everywhere there's pools everywhere they're not overcrowded the resort's not overcrowded the resort is top-notch um, I mean just everything about this place is just made us have the most amazing experience here and we totally mean that with everything 
check this out. Jason has drinks. May I serve you, madame? Yes, you may. All right, I got you, just in case, because I know women like need choices. Okay. I got you a mudslide, Ooh. and I got you a margarita. I think you need to change it up a bit. Okay. So if you're not following us on Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter, we have been posting live this entire trip. If you're not following me on the, in the pool, you're getting left. But what she said, you guys, give us a like, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell. If you like us, give us a like. We sure would appreciate all the support. We appreciate you guys very much. Yeah. So um, each hotel that you stay at has its own special hashtag. So for Unico, it's called My Unico Experience. So everything we've posted since we've been here, we've used that hashtag. So, uh, so someone else who's staying here has been checking because they're using that same hashtag and they saw the video we posted on Facebook last night. Yeah, Jason totally ate a grasshopper. Hope you didn't miss that. He says there's nothing to it. Nothing to it? <laughs> do you like when I go circles around? Yes, I do. Then you must sit still. <laughs> I don't know how to sit still. You must stop. <laughs> You're so silly. That moment you realize when the infinity pool is completely empty and you can come and jump over here and get it completely to yourself. So. We're going to enjoy having this pool completely to ourselves Honey. because that Honey. doesn't happen every day. Honey. Honey, your beer's floating away. Oh no. Oh no. It stopped. At the infinity point, it stopped. But see, this is cool. There's drains. So like here, if I push the water, it goes into a drain. At the end, if you push the water, it goes into a drain. How neat is that? We're so enjoying ourselves. So we are gonna sit here and enjoy the pool to ourselves. We're just hanging in the pool. Pretty much what she said. So we've been at the beach all day long. We are pretty much crispy critters, even yes. with the SPF 50. I when tell you, you spend this much time in the sun. It's gonna get you. We have been so careful and we're still sunburned. No, you, gonna, you don't lather up fast enough, you know, with that SPF 50. And because you're, you're just too busy having fun. Yeah. And you don't take the time to stop and reply. And that was our fault. So we are crispy. <laughs> Big deal. We're having fun. Yeah. We're winding the evening down. This is my favorite time of the day because, oh, let me adjust my hat where you can see my face. Okay. This is my favorite time of the day because the sun has gone down behind the building, <laughs> which means it's still daylight outside. This way. It's not dark outside, but the sun is blocked from our view, so that means we're in complete shade, and I don't have to worry about getting sunburned anymore, and I can be out here and enjoy the pool without worrying about the sun. True I'm story. so red, look at me. What she said. So, we are, the bar's closed, which is stupid. It's about six o'clock. There's a bar right there, and I went over there just a minute ago, and they were, they said, I can give you a beer, but no more margaritas or mixed drinks or anything like that. They're, they're not going to mix drinks anymore. 
I don't understand why they even close bars at all inclusive resorts. I don't either. Poolside. Because maybe somebody wants to stay poolside all night. There's still a lot of people. I mean, the pool's not packed by any means, but there's like 20 people in the pool. Oh, in, in this, this pool. pool. Not that pool. There's probably 20, there's probably 40, 50 people. Yeah. So. We're probably going to wrap up here in the next 15, 20 minutes, head to the room, wash up, and then get ready for dinner. Yes, we have dinner tonight at the Italian Specialty Restaurant, so that'll be good. And she can get a drink there. Yes, I can. Ooh, and we get to try out the really awesome shower in our room because it looks pretty sweet. Yeah. Are you, right. you going to get in the tub? Uh... In the morning, maybe. Maybe in the morning. Yeah. Not tonight. We don't have to leave until noon tomorrow, so we've got some time to get up and chill a bit. Yeah. So I, I have a feeling that Jason's going to wake up and fill that tub, tub in the morning. I'm a tub guy. It calms me down, relaxes my brain. Yeah. And uh, I like to sit in the tub. Or shoot, it tonight, okay, so last night we had this most epic sitting on the beach in the pitch dark, yeah. listening to the waves roll in. We could recreate that on our own balcony tonight. You could get in the tub, I could get on, there's a sofa out on the balcony. I could get on the sofa, you get in the tub, and we could totally just sit there and chill with yeah, the waves. I would, I would lean more towards putting cool water in my tub. Yeah. It's so warm out here. I think if I put the hot water in, I may with the weed. Yeah, this is like bath water. This right here. This is bath water. It's right, really, really right warm. Yeah. These, been... these pools are ridiculous. Oh my God. They're nice. <laughs> This is this so platform nice. right here that we're talking on right now. It's like in the middle of the pool. Yeah. Okay, and there's one over there, and there's one over there, and there's one over there, and there's infinity pool over there, and there's an infinity infinity pool over there. It's ridiculous. Yeah. So it's awesome. Yeah, they've got these cool platforms, so you can just come and post up, put your drinks, put your phone, put your camera, and just chill around here instead of having to worry about, oh, where am I going to put my drink? Am I going to accidentally spill it in the pool or whatever? So I think these platforms are pretty cool. Yeah. And there's stairs leading up to them too so you can if you want to want to get on yeah. top of it and dance dance do you want to do you want to get up else and dance? you could do well there. you could just like lay out a beach chair i mean a, a towel and lay out maybe no i think there's stairs up here so people can dance jason would think it's because people want to dance that's what, right. that's what he would do what, what else? I don't understand what else it could be for. <laughs> That's what I would use it for. So you see, we have shifted our drink of choice this trip. Jason is drinking pretty much exclusively Corona Light because guess what? They don't even know what Michelob Ultra is here in Mexico. I gave up at the Hard Rock. I'm like, uh, is it, Senor, what do you want? I said, Michelob Ultra. And he looked at him like he was crazy. He's like, what? Excuse, excuse me? What? Michelob Ultra. Pardon me. <laughs> Michelob Ultra. Corona? Yes, okay. Corona. corona. Okay. That's yeah. what we'll take. Corona light. So, ever <laughs> since then, man, it's been warm Corona light. And. Warm Medela Negra. Medelo. This one is warm. Like, it's not even cold. Don't call cool it Negra. At all. Don't call it Negra. Negra. It's Negra. 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 That means dark. It's dark. And I have been pretty much drinking exclusively margaritas. Um, I've tried a Miami Vice and it wasn't good. And I tried a mudslide, mudslide and it wasn't good. But they can make really good margaritas yeah. in Mexico. Yeah. So stick with the margaritas. Yeah. All right, everybody. So off to the room we go here in about five, ten minutes. We'll see you at dinner. Are we going to see him at dinner? Yes. Dinner. See you at dinner. We're all dressed for dinner. Are you ready for dinner, honey? I'm feeling fancy. You're feeling fancy? Oh, you look marvelous. This guys. is by no means a dress up for dinner. I do have a dress, but I wore that at Hard Rock. But this is called My Legs Are Burned, and the leggings feel really nice. Yeah, at least it doesn't sunburn. do burns very well. But no, you know what? I don't. I really do not do sunburns well. And here's the kicker. We use, let me show you this, come here. The entire bottle, it's empty. Yeah, so we weren't slacking, really. It's not like we didn't use sunscreen and 
And we weren't slacking, guys. That's what's crazy. We had a second one. So it's not like we were not using sunscreen. But we did not use the second one. I did. I put, I, I put it on once. I put this on one. twice. Oh. So it is not like I was not trying. I'm just so fair. And that Caribbean sun will just kick your butt. And we were on... We, and we were in umbrellas. Okay. okay, so tonight we're going to the Italian specialty dining restaurant. Mi Carissa. I am trying to pronounce that. Don't fuss at me if I say it wrong because I probably did. I would say Mi Carissa sounds pretty accurate. Sounds right? Looks right, yeah. Let's go. <laughs> Do they know us or what? They put the bread in front of me and they put the meat and cheese in front of Jason and then we've got focaccia bread. Yeah, it looks like it's cut, but it's not. So. Oh, it's hot. You're gonna have to tear it apart. And it's already got oil on it, but I'm gonna dip it in just a little bit more. There's not many things in life that beat good, fresh bread. It's fresh, it's hot, it's salted, and then it's got the oil on it. Yeah, it's good. Man, this fresh prosciutto right here, bro. I good? Could. Oh, man. What kind of cheese is that, mozzarella? No. Provolone? Not sure. Parmesan. Parmesan, interesting. So we just ordered like half the menu. Okay, I just totally pulled Anthony Bourdain on my ass. Yeah. Listen, it's our last night, why not? Yep. It's an all-inclusive, you guys. It's like being on a cruise ship. You can get more than one entree if you want. Is that taking advantage a little bit? Probably, but you know what? They are equipped to do that for you. Oh, Elisa's taking pictures. You guys, we're eating so much food. So, the portions are small. So don't feel guilty about ordering more than one. Because, like, if I would have just ordered the ravioli, there's three raviolis. I would still be hungry. So don't feel bad about ordering more than one dish. Alright, so speaking of ravioli, we're going to try this first. That is a ravioli. Formaggio, so it's a cheese ravioli. It's a next lasagna. Leave the greener even home. Uh oh. What's the verdict? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. You like that one? That's delicious. Is it good? Mm-hmm. It looks good. That's definitely delicious. That tastes you have to taste it. Because it's it's very similar to the lasagna that your mom makes and you make. Really? Yes. Oh I'm definitely tasting it. Yours is still better, I'll just be honest. Oh, Jason stop, Jason makes hands down the best lasagna I've ever had. But this is really, really good. All right, chicken parm. Let's get all the greenery off the top and get to the meat and potatoes of it. Of the three, the lasagna is the best. All right, there you go, and there you have it, folks. Yep. That's delicious, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, that's good. That just tastes like home does. Yeah. yeah. That's very good. We're gonna probably eat all that. That, yeah, that's not going to waste. Uh -uh. All right, so let's try the filet. Ooh, it looks soft. Eh. I don't like it that bloody too much. So, between the steak and the lasagna, which is better? Equal. Really? Equal. Oh, I love, I love a fresh I know, cut of meat. you're a good steak eater. Well, I'm fixing to devour that lasagna. Did we waste our food, honey? Nope. I think Empty. we ordered like seven or eight Empty. different things. Empty. Look. Almost empty. 
We ate like almost seven or eight different things. Ate just about all of them. Yep. It was our last night, we're going out with a bang. And we wanted to try all this delicious food because the food here is fantastic. Oh my God, it is. It really, really it's is. A, it's, a, it's a step up, it's, a, it's the next level. This is panna cotta with mixed berries. It looks delicious. That's good. That's really good. That, oh. I don't think I've ever had panna cotta before. I usually don't get desserts in Italian restaurants because I don't normally like like tiramisu and things like that but this is delicious so we're walking back to our room and we look down on the ground and we're like, oh look at the pretty shell someone just left a shell here and Jason turns it over and it's a crab there's a crab and it's it was sitting alive. it was sitting right here yeah and it needs the water yeah so, so we're, we're gonna go take it back we're gonna take it to the beach real quick yeah That is the coolest thing. We've never seen one of these before. Just out and about. Oh! <laughs> That's a leaf, honey. Jason put him in the water, but he doesn't want to go in the water. He's trying to get back to the building. Oh well, honey, we tried to save him. Put him back down here. He's like, I don't want to get down here with the sharks. <laughs> All right, well, bye, little crab. Best of luck to you.